Hello and welcome back to this Mass Effect Let's uh, Mass Effect 2 Let's Play where we just helped uh, Samara with her loyal to mission and we cleared out uh, the freight that was here. Uh, let's see, I didn't scan that plan, so let's do that before we head out. I think we'll scan, save the normal crash site for a little bit longer. Okay. Probe away. Before we experience that. Launching probe. Launching probe. Because I sort of feel like that is more. Appropriate. Probe away. Launching probe. Launched. Probe away. Launching probe. Probe away. Launching probe. Launching probe. Okay, that's that plan done. Uh, so let's head back. Fuel reserves at fifty percent. To this area. Let's fill up with a few. And I think we will. Pardon me. Uh, do another. Perhaps we could help Miranda, we could help Saeed, Thane, Garrus, and Kasun, Grant and Morden. Let's head over here actually. Sort of want to see what Tuchanka is like. Resources. Interesting. Well, let's touch down on Tuchanka. Maximum laughs, but sprint broke both.
seem to be one more one of the most pleasant plans, does it? Um, so let's listen into this first, shall we? What did I tell you, honey? Is stop right there, alien. Your shepherd of the Normandy. If you're looking for work, you're shouting down the wrong hole. The blood pack only recruits Krogan. Interesting. Well, let's have a shot with you. Um, maybe not. The clan leader wants to speak with you. Keep your running pet on a short leash. Get him the right soon or put him down. You know what's wrong with him. What he needs? There's nothing wrong with him. Just go speak to the clan leader. Interesting. Someday we'll get off this farm. Show those Turian troops boss. Damn right. Tear their scales off and let the Pijaks feast on them while they're still alive. Ah. Hmm. Erdnot clan reports use weak encryption. I see references to a captured Solarian in the logs of the Chief Scout. Good. Talk to Scout then. Or Chief. Either one acceptable. Also, I have been unable to access local medical records. I suggest asking the local clan leader for assistance with Grun's problem. Hmm. Let's see. So the Shaman, Bedrock's Throne, Med Lab, Chief Scout, Righteous Ware, so let's have a look there first. Were you around when the female camps and the children over last week? No. I was off dealing with a Varen attack. What? Any promising warriors? Yes, of course. They're strong. One day they will tear our enemies apart. Hmm. Looks like Urs finally found someone to follow around. Hmm. Good Varen. Hmm. Stay. <laughs> Greetings, human. My name is Ratch. Have a look at what I've got. <laughs> Everyone I talk to hates that aliens are an Erdnot, except you. I don't have the luxury of turning away paying customers. I do enough business off world to know that you aliens have more credits than people here do. Hmm. What do you have in stock? Most of it's food and drink that's toxic to humans. Rincall's a local favorite. Don't try to act tough, it'll tear your insides apart. He's not joking. Rincall hits aliens like ground glass. Otherwise, I've got weapons, scrap, and whatever food those pie jocks don't steal. Which isn't much. Take a look at my kiosk over there if you want to buy something. What the hell is a pie jack? Off-world vermin. Humans say they're like monkeys. They come in and steal food, Rincall. Whatever they can get their talons on. We started using the mounted defense cannons to stop them. I'm a good shot. Maybe I can help out with the pie jacks. Feel free. You can use the console out there to control the guns. Make a dent in the pie jack population, and you get a discount. Good luck with that. Hmm. I should go. Suit yourself. Let's see what he what he has. Hmm. Oh, interesting. A bit of extra health, a bit of extra shields. Okay. Well, maybe in a while. One of the children, probably five years from the right. This is the great Krogan homeworld. This is the land of Kredok, Shiagar, and Viol. This chunk of rock is barely worth standing on. Never thought I'd miss the tank. Hmm. Halt. 
You must wait till the clan leader summons you. He is... in talks. You know what tradition demands. Clan Erdnot must respond. Your reforms will not go unopposed. You risk appearing weak at a critical time, Shepard. Ah! Good enough. Did I just see? Did they just read the correct name? Excuse me. <laughs> How do I... It is! Shepard! <laughs> Fantastic! My friend. You look well for dead, Shepard. Should have known the void couldn't hold you. <laughs> Looks like helping me destroy Saren and the Geth has worked out for you. Glad we didn't have to kill each other on Vermeer. Uh, you made the rise of Erd not possible. Vermeer was a turning point for the Krogan, though not everyone was happy about it. Destroying Saren's genophage cure freed us from his manipulation. I used that to spur the clans to unify under Erdnot. You abandoned many traditions to get your way. Dangerous. Speak <laughs> one spoken to, Uvenk. I'll drag your clan to glory whether it likes it or not. Hmm. Now, Shepard, what brings you here? How's the Normandy? Destroyed in a collector surprise attack. I ended up spaced. Well, you look good. Ah, the benefits of a redundant nervous system. Yeah, humans don't have that. Oh, it must have been painful then. But you're standing here, and you've got a strong new ship. Takes me back to the old days. Us against the unknown, killing it with big guns. Good times. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like you've got big changes ahead for the Krogan. We are making a neutral ground where all clans are welcome. Fertile females can be shared among clans. We will strengthen the race as a whole. You threaten everything that makes us strong. It will not last. Maybe. Until then, you're lucky to be a part of it. How do you maintain security with so many different clans in one place? Any clan willing to send in hostages can come in. No fighting inside the camp. Each clan punishes its own criminals. We stop conflicts before anyone dies. Then we present a simple choice. Pay a fine and deal with your problems, or your clan is no longer welcome. Hmm. That doesn't sound very harsh by Krogan standards. Allies from other clans like what I'm doing. They help deal with skeptics. Many are eager for an outlet. Every time I've declared a clan unwelcome, my allies have destroyed them. Word gets around. Hmm. What's so important about maintaining individual clans? Every clan has different customs. Rites of passage, rules of behavior, battle songs, all unique. That diversity makes us great. No clan, not even mine, was meant to survive on its own. This sounds ambitious. How's it gone so far? Better than I'd feared. Worse than I'd hoped. It can't continue. You are going against what makes us strong. Sounds like you're not making friends. Traditionalists like Uvenk are chained Varen, always fighting, guarding their pathetic stick in the ground. When the smoke clears, I can plant the flag on their corpses and rally the rest around a new Krogan hub. Mm -hmm. Sounds like you're counting on a lot of bloodshed even after you unite. It will be slow, but I won't change what we are. Krogan are judged by the strength of our enemies. Our worst insult is to say someone's not worth killing. <laughs> what do the women of Clan Erdnot think about this plan? It was our female clan leader's idea. The neutral area is safe, and it encourages more female clans to ally with us. Attacks on Erdnot now endanger the females of all clans. Even clans that want to see me dead will defend clan Erdnot. Mm -hmm. Your women have their own clan structure? Nothing is more valuable than a fertile female. We know it. They know it. They isolate themselves for their own protection. We work together to set up breeding alliances. I can hardly do anything without Clan Leader Yuta's approval. Interesting. 
I hope that works well for your people. But back to the reason I'm here. You don't often allow aliens to do business on Tuchunka, but you're an exception. I'm looking for a Salarian. He was captured by the Blood Pack and brought here. My scout commander can direct you. He's probably near the perimeter running target practice. Don't take too much of his time. I need a constant watch on the other clans. Hmm. Interesting. I have a Krogan on my crew. He has some kind of sickness and needs treatment. <laughs> uh, sickness, yeah, sure. Where are you from, whelp? Was your clan destroyed before you could learn what is expected of you? I have no clan. I was tank bred by Warlord Okir. My line distilled from Kredok, Moro, Shiagar. You recite warlords, but you are the offspring of a syringe. I am pure Krogan. You should be in awe. Okir is a very old name. A very hated name. That's He's not good. Dead. Of course. You're with Shepard. How could he be alive? <laughs> Interesting. I need Grunt back up to speed. What's wrong with him? There's nothing wrong with him. He's becoming a full adult. Ah, puberty ritual. Common among species with hormone-driven reproductive urges. I don't care what aliens call it. Krogan undergo the rite of passage. Too far, Rex. Your clan may rule, but this thing is not Krogan. Hmm. Idiot. So, Grunt, do you wish to stand with Erdnot? What does the rite of passage require? Not for me to say, Shepard. The shaman will discuss that. Mm -hmm. You'll let a tank-bred Krogan join Clan Erdnot? Only because he's with you. After all, you and I killed thousands like him. Not quite as big, but many. Clan Erdnot is strong, and the others will do as I say. They see the benefit of my vision. Interesting. What happens if he doesn't do this rite of passage? If he was left here, he would be killed. The clanless are not respected. A tank bred, probably more so. His disposition is what it is, right or no. That's just him being a Krogan. Okir didn't tell you that in the tank. Did he, boy? Hmm. This is his choice. It is in my blood. It is what I am for. Good boy. Speak with the shaman. He's over on the second level. Give him a good show and he'll set you on the path. You too, Shepard. How many times have you stepped in a mess for your crew, hmm? Far too many times. I need to go. We'll go over this another time. Watch yourself, Shepard. Tuchanka isn't safe and homey like Pharaohs and Ilos. Fair enough. You see that special they had on the extranet? That crap rots your brain. You should be out hunting. I'll tear you apart! You don't have the plates to try. Hmm. Interesting. Let's see. Watch it, human. Well, let's talk with him first. Go away. The envoy to the female clans doesn't have to listen to aliens. Interesting. Okay. You Let's go talk beyond you. yourself, Gadatagovank. The rights of Erdnot are dominant. How do we know it will challenge him? He's unnatural. The beasts of the right could ignore him like a lump of plastic. They know blood no matter the womb. Your barking does not help your case. I'll speak for myself. This is the tank bread. It is very lifelike. Smells correct as well. Your protests ring hollow, Uvank. <laughs> Erdnot Rex has given us permission to seek clan status for Grunt. Permission? <laughs> that is good enough, if lacking in spirit. <laughs> if this must stand on ritual, then I invoke a denial. My Krantz stands against him. He has no one. <sighs> My patience is tested, but Uvank invokes correctly. Grunt, who is your Krant? Your allies willing to kill and die on your behalf. 
How is a candidate tested if he brings backup on his rite of passage? Not every Krogan can be the strongest warrior, but each must inspire his peers to battle at his side. If the ones who know you best can find nothing worthy in you, you should wander the wastes and die alone before you weaken my clan. We stand with Grunt as shipmates and comrades. Shipmates are not the same thing. But I grant you aliens your simple interpretation. Aliens don't know strength. My followers are true, Krogan. Everything about Grunt is a lie. Mm -hmm. What the hell is your issue? What have you got against Grunt? It doesn't matter if one of our own made him. He is a manipulation. He may as well be the genophage in the flesh. The genophage defines the weak. My bloodline will make us stronger. You sound like Rex. Bringing radical change that threatens our core. We have gone too far already. <laughs> this is about politics. You maneuver like the Citadel Council. Does your Krant also fight with words? You dare slander me in such a way? Impressive! You challenged with words, their natural weapon. And your Krant sees how your position weakens, Uvank. <laughs> Common, you cannot decide in his favor. What about Krogan tradition if you pollute the right? You, you dare. I was a warrior before your mother was born. I speak with the authority of centuries. I decide who is worthy. That is the end of it. I have other means to oppose this. Sounds interesting. You have provoked them. Reason enough for me to like you. They're <laughs> your problem now. Oh, interesting. Um... Do we need any special equipment? To begin the right, only the candidate and his crant are required. You love battle, don't you, Shepard? The last gasp of a dying opponent. Bring your love of the fight to Grunt's trial, and he will succeed. Will do. Is that Krogan gonna be a problem? He is forbidden to interfere, will he? During the rite of passage, you must be ready for anything, Shepard. From what you've shown me, you will not disappoint. Interesting. We've waited long enough. Tell us how this works. Still your impatience, Shepard. For now, know that Grunt will be tested and that you must adapt. Okie dokie. I think we'll do this in the next episode and we'll do the other loyalty mission as well, so... Uh, we'll we'll return this. when we're ready. When the young Krogan is prepared, Bloodshed in the right must not be rushed. Sure thing. So I with that, ahead. So with that, thank you very much for watching. And when we come back, we'll uh, be doing Grunt's loyalty mission, and we'll try to do uh, uh, my mind has gone back, but. Uh, the Solarians loyal to mission. But until then, thank you very much for watching and I hope you tune into the next one. See ya!